Another aspect in energy sector is related to electric vehicles, and China is also dominant in part of the supply chain. It has to do with the Biden administration's urging to boost electric vehicle use. The plan looks to help achieve climate goals, but it may have an unintended consequence. On the flip side of lowering emissions, more electric cars on the road might deepen America's dependence on a certain Chinese supply chain. For the first time ever, production of electric vehicles or EVs used up more cobalt than smartphones and personal computers last year. Cobalt is a rare metal needed to make lithium-ion batteries. Data shows that EV production used nearly 60,000 tons of cobalt in 2021, 34% of all cobalt demand. Making mobile phones used around 15%, and personal computers totaled only 9%. Those numbers are a reflection of the growing EV market. A report from the International Energy Agency says EV sales doubled in 2021, from 4% in 2020 to 8.5% in the next year. The large use of cobalt highlights a big obstacle for the EV industry, sourcing enough material to make the batteries. Cobalt is a huge problem. Three quarters of it comes from the Democratic Republic of Congo where China and London dominate metals mining. The second largest cobalt supplier is Australia. But according to the Cobalt Institute, Australia provides only around 3% of the cobalt supply.